I hear the term daddy issues, it's from someone being super judgy over how a woman is dressed. She has her titties all out? Well, she probably has abandonment issues. Hey, maybe she does. Or maybe she just wants to show off her cool ass boobs. I mean, I have a daddy issue right now. My dad lives in the apartment above my apartment, so he's like my neighbor, but he's my dad. So he's super invested in everything I do, specifically how I throw out my trash. You know, kid, I looked outside and I, I saw the trash cans, right? You gotta separate it, kid. I'll put it in the bag, I'm gonna take it out. I'm probably gonna take it out Thursday or maybe 10 p.m. or maybe 10 or 5 p.m. I might walk down the stairs. You know, I, I, should, be a, I should be a garbage man. <laughs> Or one of our trash can lids went missing, and like I heard about that for like four weeks. And then they took the lid. They took the, the somebody took the, the, the lid. The lid to the trash can. They took it. And I, I really hope the neighbors stop with the dog poop. I'm gonna follow them. I'm gonna follow them next time. I'm gonna grab the dog poop kid. I'm gonna take it. And I'm gonna take it to the house. I'm gonna say this is your trash. Daddy garbage issues is what I got. So I wanted to get deeper into these daddy issues we all have. So I decided to invite a psychologist and a cool friend. I'm here with Naomi and Dr. Nilu, and we're gonna be talking about daddy issues. So when you hear the term daddy issues being used, what do you guys think of? I, when I hear the term daddy issues, I think it's always used to describe acting out for attention, but specifically male attention. It's important to remember that men also have daddy issues, not just women. You know, as a strong black woman, um, I have what uh, is known in medical terms as a Jew boo. That's a Jewish boo. Now, am I dealing with an issue there? Because obviously my daddy wasn't a petite white man. And yet, that is who I've taken into my heart. What am I doing? What am I doing, doctor? Sorry, what's the question? I don't know. Lay back, okay. relax. Oh, God, yeah. So maybe you chose someone who's like the opposite of your dad because you were afraid that... That checks out. That? Yeah. That checks out. Yeah. You know, Jubus are very stable. Yeah. I'm sure you've read that in your literature. Very stable, stable people. Sometimes, not always. That's a generalization. I don't know. I'm spitballing here. Those thoughts don't just come out of nowhere. They're based on your self-image. They're based on your world views and your core beliefs. I love me some CBT. Yeah, good. <laughs> Trying to handle my stuff. business, you know? Oh, it's good stuff. Mm. Both my mom and my dad were really cool. And one memory that I have is like, I cried once, I came home from school once crying, and my dad was like, what's wrong? And he, he, I told him that this guy that I liked, liked my best friend, and I just remember him being like, don't worry, like, you're gonna meet a great guy someday, and he's gonna be like, special for you. And like, he just gave me this pep talk that was so amazing. <laughs> And like, I even remembered it in my 20s and been like, oh yeah, I always remember that. That's like, so meant awesome. A lot. That's so sweet. Yeah, that's great. Oh, that makes me want to yeah. drink. Here on Report Card, we like to grade our topics. So today, we're going to be grading using the label Daddy Issues. Who's your daddy? What we have is our own grading system. <laughs> a is, I love it when you call me Big Papa. B is, say his name, say his name. C is, I'm a Freudian scholar. D is you're grounded, and F is go fuck your mom. One, One two, two, three. three. Bam! Oh, wow, we don't like it. We both said you're grounded, and you said, what was, what did you say? Go fuck your mama. Wow. All right, thanks for being here. I hope Thank you guys you for had fun. Me. I had a lot of fun. And you know what? Good luck with all those dads out there. I hope you guys liked this episode of Report Card. If you did, you know, like that video. And definitely subscribe because there's tons of new episodes of Report Card about tons of topics. Like it just goes on and on and on. Daddy issues, herpes, witches, social media, relationships. What's next? I don't know. You want me to talk about something? Comment below.